we'll be talking about the state you see, Montana. And here's an interesting little piece of information that probably you'll never have any use for. <laughs> More people go from east to west through Montana than from west to east and always have. In the early days, it made sense because, you know, they came from the populated east to the open spaces in the west. But also the rivers ran east and west. And so travel did because the rivers were the highways. But now we have highways whichever direction, but they still go more west and go east. Now, there was an exception to that, and that was the Spanish. The Spanish, the earliest Caucasians to come to this land, came from the south, old Mexico, coming north, looking for the seven golden cities of Cibola. Remember we talked about that one time, Coronado? Well, Coronado, on that expedition, gave us our name in Montana. He came into Wyoming, Montana, saw the mountains, gave it the Spanish word for mountains, Montana. We corrupted it to Montana. But on that same trip, it was been in August of 1544, he wrote in his diary, uh, the local natives, he said, call their land the land of the shining mountain. Those of us that live, for we do, in the Rockies, like the old Indian name, very much. Now, the, it's a long state, though. Now, the, 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 the Sioux Indians lived in the Great Plains in the East, they saw a totally different world and had a totally different name. They called this land the land of the big sky. 